Today we're going to take a look at the Vankyo Performance V630W projector. This is a full 1080p resolution projector. Walmart has them for about 300 bucks. I've been asked how well does it work with gaming, so we will take a look at that as well. Got some pretty cool features. You can do screen mirroring from your phone through Wi-Fi. Maximum projection size of 300 inches. 280 lumens, again, native 1080p resolution. You can see some of the specifications for it here. So along with the remote, you're also going to receive the projector, obviously along with one HDMI cable, some AV cables, and a little cleaning kit to get the uh, dust out of the vents. Over to the side, you're going to have two HDMI ports, your SD card slot. Up here, you can adjust the angle and everything of your picture. Get some more vents on the side. Pretty simple little setup. Like I said, for $300, not a bad deal. Let's see if this projector is actually decent for gaming. I mean, for $300, I don't expect it to do amazing things, but as far as just the menus and stuff, so far, so good. Let's see what happens once we actually get into an actual game. Just the intro video is pretty crisp, looks good. But that's obviously no input from me. Let's actually get into a game and see what happens. Oh, it's got custom. It really matters for this, but let's just stick with the 720s. Weather, eh, we'll, leave it. we'll leave everything like that. Rain, 20 components. Let's see what happens. As far as brightness and quality, everything there looks good. But again, I'm concerned about input once we actually start. I definitely do need to get a screen, but so far, so good. Well, obviously, I can't drive, but Okay, 
not mean to do that. Why the hell did I just do that? It has been so long. Is it bad that I've already forgot the controls on this damn thing? There we go. Okay. I apologize about beating the horse. My bad. Okay. Just a little bit that I'm doing here. Everything's pretty smooth. Um, I really don't notice any kind of input lag or anything like that. It's pretty much doing what I want it to do. And see if we can find something to shoot at real quick and see how that goes. Looks great. Sounds great. We'll go here in a minute and play with something a little more competitive, like something some online play will have and see how that goes. Absolutely terrible at this game. Control. Defend all zone. Use all your senses. Sight, sound, touch, I will say, uh, control-wise, this is extremely smooth. I don't notice any kind of bad movement or anything like that. Everything seems pretty solid here. Pretty solid, pretty solid, not bad. Hey, this we won. How about that? The war still rages. I mean, that was a terrible example for one game, but hey. Switch sides and rewrap them and do it again. Let's do it. Capture the field. This is your time to shine. nothing to do with the projector, that's just me being a terrible player. That's all that is. Damn. I'm absolutely terrible at this, like I said. It absolutely has nothing to do with the projector, it's strictly me, i tell you that. Holy shit! Is there another way in? To hopefully not get killed so easily? Can I be flanked from another angle? Let's Enemy go this way.
so I don't know why he's not dead. A little lag there, but that's just, I'm on Wi-Fi, so that's a big part of it. It has nothing to do with the projector again. Shit. Decent projector for gaming. This would definitely do well for that. Uh, I'm having absolutely zero issues. Uh, playing around with it for a while. Every game that I tried, the input extremely smooth. No issues as far as that goes. Um, I think for the price, 300 bucks. I think that's what I paid for it again does extremely well, the colors are good, it's bright, uh, I said no input lag, the sound's decent considering this is still using the onboard speaker that came with it. Um, I have no complaints for 300 bucks, I don't know if you can get another one you know, that's going to have that kind of quality in that price range. So would I recommend it for gaming, or movies, or just anything for a budget projector? 100% I would. You're not going to beat the price for $300. You're not going to beat the quality and the features that it has built in. I say it's definitely a great buy. I will link it down below as far as where you can go purchase it at. A lot of the Walmarts are carrying it right now I know of. You may be able to get it on Amazon a couple other places. But yeah, I would definitely recommend to go pick one up if you're looking for a cheap projector for your games, for movies, or just whatever it may be. I would definitely say it's the way to go.